Hey there guys, Mobile Gamer here, and today we're working in Brave Frontier, and we're going to be doing Frontier Hunter Terminus 28. And instead of running it with a full team of Omni units and getting as many points as we can, I want to go through with 7 star units, just for the people who don't have Omni units, just to show that you can still get all of the rewards from Terminus. So the team comp comes in with Avani as my leader, we have Hale as a friend leader, then we have Alanon for elemental buffs and burst healing, Lafiel for mitigation, Spark, or BBH on Spark and damage, and we have Farsen for critical, and then we have Naomi as a nuker and just a big damage dealer in general. So there's a few sets of rounds that you really need to watch out for. Um, there are some other sets of rounds that are just basically spamming all SBBs. But in the first round, you want to make sure not to kill any of the units before turn 3, just so that you can get all of your units' brave bursts up, all of your elemental damage, critical damage, other buffs up. And then you can have those SBBs and BBs for the third turn. Which, and like this is kind of tough to do because I have Avani as my leader and she has huge spark damage boost and she also has uh, increased hit amount which does more damage to the enemies which can be kind of rough if you're trying to keep damage to a minimum but it happens. The next the next round I guess, I think it's race and Nemeth gear, they're nothing to worry about, you just spam all SBBs, you'll be fine. It's either the third or fourth round where Roche comes in, or Roche, or however you want to pronounce it, and there's a little bit of damage there that you kind of should mitigate for, but it's nothing too powerful. I just used Alanon's elemental mitigation, and I did that on accident. I actually wanted to attack with him, but um, I used his damage mitigation, and that worked just fine, so 50% mitigation should keep you all kinds of good. Um, you basically just want to kill Roche as fast as possible. I used Naomi's Brave Burst at first to get the critical hit rate up and the BB attack up and normal attack up just so that we would do more damage on that first turn. And then the next turn I put um, Avani's hit count up buff, um, Alanon's elemental damage buff, and then I did Naomi's SBB for the huge damage. Normal attack with the rest so I could get all my super brave burst back, and then that worked out just fine. I forget if it's either the fourth or the fifth round, but there is one round in here that has four units, and that's basically your optimal round to use your UBB and get a bunch of points. So you can use whoever's UBB that you want. I would prefer using a damage boosting UBB, but um, I used Naomi's because she has the 100% spark critical buff on there, which is pretty good for damage. I could have used Avani's because she does spark damage up as well, but it doesn't really matter, you'll still get a bunch of points for it, and that's where the majority of your points will come from for the entire Frontier Hunter Terminus. The last one is three enemies, I know one of them is serious, I don't know the other two because you can just kill them in one, like one spamming of your SBB, so that works pretty easily. Other than that, there's not much to go through, I guess. You can see at the end of the video that I show that I did get all the rewards. I got like six or a million six hundred thousand points, and the minimum you need is a million three hundred thousand points, I think. So you can get the um, Leguan gem from that, and it's a pretty good sphere. So other than that, nothing much to say. Mobile Gamer out. See you next video. Bye bye.